In preparation for the library's sale of $2 million construction bonds, Moody's reviewed the district's bond rating. Moody's Bond Rating Service has continued the district's AA2 rating. This signifies that the district's obligations are judged to be of high quality and are subject to a very low credit risk. At the same time, Moody's changed its bond outlook from stable to negative. This reflects Sir Shiari's appeals, declining fund balance, and potential state aid reductions. As we just reviewed, tax certiaries and SCARs are reverting to pre-financial crisis levels. This should help fund balance to slowly increase while instructional services are maintained. How did this bond sale go? On the day of the sale, municipal rates for AA credit rating for 22-year terms were 4.02%. The district's rate was 3.70%. Thus, the district bonds priced at one-third of a percent less below the general market. Any questions on that? What needs to be clear is the bond rating, although it was reported as a reduction, it is not a reduction. It was the outlook based on certain factors. We think some of those factors will reverse themselves. So going forward, we think things will go better. But looking at the district's credit worthiness, that bond rating has remained the same. Yes, but since they're under our auspices financially, um, it's our bond rating. So, uh, uh, does a negative outlook uh, increase the interest rate, or it's just based on the AA2 rating? It, it's both. And looking at the AA2 rating and the outlook, even though the outlook went from stable to negative, the district got a better rating than comparable districts. This will be reviewed f f the next time we go out for bonding as well. But one of the things Moody's took into consideration is that we have a low debt burden. And we saw that when we talked that our debt expenses are 4% of operations this year compared to 6% about seven or eight years ago. So they look at things like that, how we manage. Thank you.